Hey, my name is Joshua Turner Sims. I'm excited about the opportunity to be considered for the Director of Strength and Performance at Genesis Public Schools. I've always had a passion for sports, dating back to when I was little. Uh, we had season tickets to Alabama football games. Uh, in high school, I was a two-sport athlete playing football and baseball. And then after high school, I played two years of college baseball at Enterprise State Community College. Uh, after completing my two years at Enterprise, I went on to attend Jacksonville State University. I um, got an undergrad in kinesiology with a minor in psychology. Um, I was an intern with the strength and conditioning staff. Uh, this was a great experience where I got to understand the foundations of performance training. After earning my Bachelor of Science at JSU, I went on to the University of Alabama and earned a Master of Arts in Sports Administration. While there, I was a strength and conditioning intern working with the football and baseball team. While working with the football team, I got to see firsthand the commitment it takes to sustain being a winning program. Um, a lot of the championship principles I learned there, I use, and it's helped shape my coaching and leadership philosophies. Uh, I continued my coaching career at Rapid Sports Performance, where I assisted in training young athletes, and then recently at Fury Performance Academy, a multi-sport training facility, I designed and implemented uh, training programs for male and female athletes that played various sports. The Director of Strength and Performance position is of interest to me because I can tell that Genesis Public School System and the community is committed to excellence by their first class facilities for their students and athletes. Uh, for me, this is an opportunity not to just train athletes to become bigger, faster, and stronger, but also prepare them to succeed in life. I believe there are five qualities of a winning program. Commitment, discipline, toughness, effort, and pride. And with the use of an umbrella, I'm going to help demonstrate how these five qualities work together. All right, an umbrella is used to help protect you from external elements. Okay, the spokes in the umbrella are represented by the five qualities of a winning program. We have commitment, each member focusing on one goal. We have discipline, short-term sacrifice for long-term achievement. We have toughness, ability to overcome mental and physical obstacles. And we have effort, amount of mental and physical energy exerted towards a task, and we have pride, believing in something bigger than yourself. With all these working together, this umbrella will be unstoppable. Now that we've talked about the five qualities of winning, let's talk about what it takes to build a winning culture. Okay, I got to see firsthand at Alabama the commitment it takes to sustain a winning program for a long period of time. All right, the first thing we need to do is examine our present culture. We need to make sure that our strengths outride our, our weaknesses and challenges. We need to ensure that everybody involved with the program, coaching staff, administration, players, community, we all have the same vision, okay? We need to, and we also need to determine, the players, we need to determine who's gonna embrace our new culture, and these guys are gonna be our leaders, all right? We need to empower our leaders, because our leaders are gonna be the foundation of our culture for a long period of time. All right, these leaders are gonna be a byproduct of an interdependent culture of leadership. They're going to let every player know that they, they have a purpose on this team. And no one player is more important than the other. And when this team works together, right, we are going to have a great chance of winning. And we are going to build a legacy. So now that we know what it takes to build a legacy, how do you start? You start with, start with the foundation. All right, with six traditional elementary schools housed in the Jenison Public School District, you know, we, there's an opportunity to expose these young children to interdependent leadership. All right, we can start with summer camps, which has the opportunity to generate funds as well as introduce children to athletics at a foundational age. And then we have weekly mentorship programs. We pair junior high and high school athletes with elementary students to promote this healthy relationship. All right, and then you know, as we promote this healthy relationship, we can also we can also recognize some untapped potential in these young athletes and be able to improve the long-term athletic development. One aspect of this position that really excited me was your vision for the future. All right, with the future facility at 61,000 square feet, there are many ways that we can use this facility. Here are some examples. Uh, Multi-sports practices, sports competitions and camps, uh, banquets, we can allow third-party organizations to use the facility and help operate the facility, and we can also host weekend warrior fitness classes. Uh, my name is Joshua Tanner Sims. Growth excites me. Innovation excites me. This opportunity excites me. I believe with my education, my experience, and my work ethic, I can be Jenison Public Schools' next Director of Strength and Performance. Thank you.